guys, it's Red, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back for some more of Mafia 3. I was not planning to dip out for as long as I did, you guys. I had some serious issues with my PC that I had to get fixed. And then I changed my background. I painted my background, my entire room, which took, it took days. It took longer than I had thought it was going to take, so I do apologize, guys. But we're back to see Donnie. Dug it out! Dug it out! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'm gonna show you in the goddamn face. Now we're even. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Time to call Enzo. <sighs> Alright. Tile this. Yeah. Barclay Mills is gone. All of it. Who the fuck is this? Take a guess. Got a lot of nerve calling me like this. You know who the fuck I am? I know exactly who you are, Enzo. Your mom Enzo. Was just lost control of his district. Enzo. Probably end up you next to Michael Greco. You goddamn coward. You want me dead? Be a man. Do it yourself. I don't want you dead, Enzo. I want to make a deal. <laughs> Jesus Christ, son. You need to get your fucking head examined. You tell me who's behind the construction of Marcano's casino, and I'll do what I can to keep that WAP asshole from killing you. Why the fuck should I think you could protect me from Marcano? Look at what I did to you. Meet me at the quarry. Next time, don't let me catch you napping. Mm. Kiss my ass. <laughs> and he goes right back to sleep? No. A little late for that. Get Enzo Conti's story mission. Talk to Enzo. Enzo Conti. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need a ride. Let's get a ride. What are we feeling? How about sending some new wheels to Delray Hollow? Aye, I'll get around to you right away. Okay, good. So I don't know if I look too dark. I feel like the lighting has changed because the. Ca Where are you taking my car? Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you, darling. In here. Put the gun away. If I wanted you dead, Enzo, I wouldn't have walked through the front door. All the same, I ain't taking no chances. I ain't taking no chances. That's a smart fella. Hold on here. I know you. You're Lincoln Clay, right? Lived with Sammy Robinson? Went off to Nam? That's right. <laughs> Christ, son, if I'd have known that, we could have saved ourselves a whole lot of trouble. Follow me. What? What? You probably don't know this. What does he mean? Sammy and I went way back. He was a good man. Didn't deserve what happened to him. Hell, none of y'all did. And this shit with the casino? It's a giant fuck you from Sal to every man who ever worked for him. He wants to go legit and fuck the rest of us in the process. Mm. Guess it's well past time I fucked him back. <sighs> you okay, know Enzo? Remy Duval? Sure, he's the big shot on the radio. Without him, there's no casino. He owns the land, runs a construction company, you name it. So, these are all fronts? Yeah, they're bullshit. Created a big paper trail to protect himself in case everything falls apart. And Marcano doesn't own any of the land? <clears throat> nah, it all belongs to Duval. Mm. He's no idiot. Long as it's in his name, Sal can't touch him. 
How do I find him? He lives up in Frisco Fields. But from what I hear, Olivia Marcano is keeping close tabs on him, forcing him to stay low. The last thing Sal needs is for his sole legitimate partner to get into trouble. We should get moving. Looks like it's a little late for that. Uh-oh. 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 Deal's a deal. Deal's a deal. Let's go. Oh, so we're gonna... Okay. Okay. So he can hang back. Enzo can hang back. Kill Marcano's hit crew. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they do any more. Ooh, I'm a little rusty. Okay. Stay right there. There we go. Nice. I'm trying to see where the gunshots are coming from. I can't see. I can see your little head though. Did I get you? No, I didn't. He's glitching out. You see that? That's a little glitch if I've ever seen one. There we go. <laughs> I had to time it correctly. Is that a person? <gasps> it is. Oh. 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 Is there more? <gasps> Jesus Christ! Oh my god, Enzo, get up here. Are you mad? The music with this is a little funny. <laughs> Fitting, though. This whole place is going to catch. On fire, is it not? Okay, this this spot should be good. We should be good here. Come on, show your face, show your face. Ooh. That's where I want to stay. To sell. Seriously? Plant explosives in the quarry? Because he doesn't want to leave this all to Sal? <laughs> I mean, fair enough. Um, okay. Oh, so one over here and one over the other side? Anybody in here? No, I don't think so. Right there's the first batch. Rig that one up, then we'll move on to the rest. We'll move on to the More rest. About these explosives. That's life in a quarry. Yeah. Back in the day, we tried sticking our peckers in the ground and fucking <coughs> the stone out, but all we ended up with was chap nut sacks. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. His mouth movements when he uh, laughed was a little creepy. A little creepy. Ooh, do, do, do. I feel like once we go over to this other side, we're going to get jumped. There's going to be more people for sure. Oh. 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 There's two more. It's not just one area that we have to go to. How do we get up there then? How do we get up there? I don't know. Let's do this one first. Oh sh! Oh come on! Oh, so I'd, I'd be, I'd, I'd be so serious. No, I don't think so. How? Where? Oh, thank you, Enzo. Appreciate that. I really do. I'm empty. Oh no! Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a Molotov. Okay. 
Okay, one over here. That takes care of that. That takes care of that. Oh, he's moving up. Let's go. Let's go. Enzo is crazy. He's out in the open with it. Damn, cut that sack of shit down. <laughs> oh, there you are, you cheeky list. What are you doing? He's taking out the whole team. Oh, there's another one. Run for cover. There's someone over here. There you are. Running for cover. Oh, hello. What are you doing down there? Oh, guys, they keep coming. Oh, I missed him! Oh, I missed him! Okay. Ah! Do I have to, like, move up? I feel like they're just gonna keep spawning in somehow. Some way. You killed one of our boys. Oh, I killed one of your boys. I did kill one of your boys. Covering my ass. I mean, the building is only so big. I, you can't all fit in there. Missed it. I missed it. I missed the shot. I missed the shot. I'm going in. Face to face, you and me, motherfucker. Face to face, yeah. Jo Enzo. I mean, I appreciate it, but I had that. I had that in the bag. Okay. This is a whole lot of explosives. I wouldn't okay. even be comfortable yeah. Why wouldn't I be? around this much. For you. Not some of them, all of them. All of them, you say? Wow, Enzo. How things change. So, yeah, it is more. Here they come. Yeah. Oh, Enzo. Oh, Enzo. They haven't seen us? The hell? I think oh, we got him. That's a bad idea. Uh, they didn't see us. I don't understand why they didn't, like, shoot. I mean, it was fairly obvious where we were. Ooh, they're coming. Enzo is crazy helpful. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That was it. Enzo is just, I mean, wow. Oop, 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 oopa, 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 oopa. You want a grenade? You can have one. Stay there. Yes. <laughs> he tried running, but it was too late. All right, let's plant them. Escape the quarry. Good idea. I think that is a good idea. Oh, I just walked into a wall. Are more going to show up? I wouldn't be surprised. But maybe not. Hmm. Okay. I guess I've got to go in. Yep, in here. God damn. You like? No. Me like. It's like a Land Rover. Oh. Do I really have to? Okay. 
Have to press the button to open the garage. Give me there and I'll make a financial contribution to your cause. They got it blocked, but I bet we can bust through the gate. What about oh, the train I think tunnel? we can. The tunnel. <laughs> it's your call. Oh. Mm, let's go through the tunnel. This is way more fun. Boom. And boom goes the night. <laughs> Where is that from? Where is that from? I don't know. Anyway, the tunnel is very much um, preoccupied. <laughs> was totally not expecting that to be the case. Uh-oh, sorry. So sorry. So sorry. Oh, they're coming in cars as well. Enzo is crazy. He's leaning out the window. He's... It's a full-on car chase. The witness is calling the police. Okay, forget it. Forget the witness. Extremely dangerous. Additional units on route. Um, lose Marcano's men is basically is the objective. It's not basically the it is the objective. I'm still loving Enzo's leaning out of the window. Have I done it? No, I haven't. One more car. We just have to lose one more car. Okay. We should be good now, I feel like. We should be good now. I'm gonna go down here. No, he's coming again. Where am I dropping you? I got this girl, Henrietta. Shacks up at the Carousel Hotel in the hollow. Smart as a fucking whip. I left a fucking bag with her. Should have all I need to get by. Two tears in a bucket. So yeah, me and Sammy back in the day, we had these two knockouts. And we was drinking, partying, having the time of our lives. This was uh, 1942. No, 43. He must have been about the age you are now. And the girl with your old man, she starts getting into the making out. But she got a problem. Sammy's passed out cold. Told you he was drunk off his ass. But this girl was into him, so she gives him the benefit of the doubt. Keeps trying. Smacks him a bit. Wakes him up. But every time she starts getting into it, Sammy drops. Poor bastard couldn't stay awake to save his fucking life. Finally, she's had enough and storms out of there, cursing a goddamn blue streak. And do you know who that woman was? Perla? Perla? <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Perla didn't move to New Bordeaux until 44. I'll show you who it was. I got the photo right here. Are you kidding me? Sammy had a shot with her? She was passing through on her way to Hollywood, but it all worked out, didn't it? Sammy wound up with Perla. The love of his life. God damn, I miss those days. Fucking Sal. Yep. <clears throat> uh, I just wanted to hear that con conversation, guys, so that's why I pulled over. But here we are at the hotel. This is good right here. Okay. Sorry again about what happened to Sammy and Ellis. Appreciate it. He's a lot better than I thought he was going to be, Enzo. And a great, great shot. <laughs> 
Um, probably even better than me, which wouldn't be hard to, um, He's obviously clock. better than me. <laughs> what am I saying? Goers. This is our first step toward breaking Marcano and taking over the city. I hear what y'all got to say, but I decide who gets the turf, and in the end, my decision is final. Your decision? Listen here. You put my men on the front line and locking down the action, I consider your decision fucking made. Ain't nothing to discuss. That ain't exactly true. Because doling out pieces of the city is a hell of a lot bigger deal than having a couple of meatheads lock down some action. All I'm saying. First I'm hearing of any action in this part of the city, which is fine, but it don't change my stance that this turf ought to come to me. Ah, uh, the sit down. You've already assigned the rackets in this district. <laughs> but now you must assign this district to one of your underbosses and all bets are off. Deciding who will run this district will reassign its rackets to your chosen underboss. So, okay. Assigning a district to one of your underbosses will unlock more favors and improve the amount of kickback you'll collect while making them more loyal to you. Underbosses might resent not getting a district, which could have consequences down the road. But if you really want to get the most out of any single underboss, you'll need to make the hard choices. You trusted me this far, Lankin. No sense changing course now. Okay. There's only one smart play. We got a long road ahead of us. Oh, Don't beautiful. This works blood. then. This works beautifully. What's the word, Lincoln? What's the word, Lincoln? <laughs> What's the word, Lincoln? <laughs> you know I can handle this. This is so weird, guys. I'm towing the line, Lincoln. That's got to mean something. Just the whole setup of Mafia. And I know I keep saying that. Um, Cassandra has two current districts. Um, two current rackets in, in the district. Vito has none. You're in me. We have Thomas has none. Right? What? I have no idea. So what's it gonna be, Chief? What's it gonna be, Chief? Hey, what's it gonna be, Chief? I'm here as long as it takes, brother. It's never an easy answer. Trust me, I know. Yeah. You see, no change if I choose Cassandra. Well, there is a change. There's no change if I choose. I'm just gonna choose Cassandra. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta say, this action's perfect for Cassandra. Yeah. All right. I'll make sure our people are coordinating things between the holla and here. I guess that's that. And make sure you don't fuck it up. Well, I ain't exactly throwing a big bash over your decision, but for the time being, I can live with it. We're done for now. You'll hear from me if I need you. Vito's my favorite. Cassandra's second. Thomas. <laughs> That's my favorites in order. But I can't give it all to Vito. I mean, I could. I'm pretty sure I could, right? But I don't. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't want what to. What a prick. Turns out you were right. I gotta go. Thank you for this. Happy hunting, Donovan. <sighs> Miss Lancaster's helping me with a side project. You get a name at Enzo? Yeah. Remy Duval. He's not only building the casino, he also owns all the land where it's being built. Remy Duval? The jackass on the radio? His family's been down here a couple hundred years. Thinks it makes him everyone's massa. According to this, he heads up the Southern Union in his spare time. The Southern Union's basically the fucking clan. You know, right before I shipped out, Father James was with some other folks protesting the fact that the city didn't have any black cops. Southern Union came in and kicked the shit out of everybody they could get their hands on. Day after, they spray painted God hates niggers across the front of his church. If President Andrew Johnson had actually executed those traitorous fucks, we wouldn't have this goddamn problem. Enzo also mentioned Olivia Marcano. Olivia's an outlier. Old Southern money. She's the one that was married to Sal's brother, Lucho. At least until someone slit his throat. And she runs Frisco Fields. Ever since Lucho died. 
She expanded his drug business and opened a PCP lab. Mm. And since a lot of mafiosos live up there, she probably just has a place they can <coughs> socialize. Well, it's usually in the back of some business. I never knew the mob had women as capos. She's there to keep Duval in line. Only people these entitled pricks listen to were other entitled pricks. So who are you gonna go after first? Duval. Since he owns the land where the casino's being built, killing him will muddy things up. You think hitting Olivia's businesses will help draw him out? I've known racist assholes like him my entire life. Black man like me running around terrorizing white folks. He ain't gonna be able to let that stand. His pride will bring him down. Ooh, you know, that good plan, Lincoln. Good luck out there. Hmm, earned a marker. Okay. Uh, disposable, disposable people. Okay. <laughs> New vehicle unlocked. Okay. Now that Enzo Conti's gotten the F out of Dodge, you can head up to Frisco Fields and deal with Sal's capo, Olivia Marcano. Ugh. Okay. Capo Olivia Marcano. Olivia's more of a necessary evil than a valued family member. But Frisco's home to Marcano and all his mobbed up pals. By hitting her first, you'll shake the new Bordeaux elite to their very core. Yeah, because that means we can get close to them. And the they feel like... On the right. What? Story mission unlocked PCP. Talk to Bear Donnelly. Okay. Yeah, Marcano's in a circle feel untouchable. So we have to... We have to show them that they too can get touched. How about sending <laughs> some new wheels to Delray Hollow? Aye, I'll get around to you right away. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. Oh, someone's stuck in traffic. Hello, do you have my car? Oh, he does that. Why, why, why? I mean, I get it, but honestly. Got a car here for you. Oh dear. Do <laughs> right. Right. So we're going to try not to do any DLCs <laughs> until we want to do DLCs. Um uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Talk to Bear Donnelly. Unhappy in the Irish mob, Bear's ambitions have brought him to the streets of Frisco Fields. And, oh, it's the same, right? <laughs> uh, Southern Union, Donovan's called in a favour with a friend who carries shared interest in, Frisco's, in Frisco Fields. Okay. So yeah, two. Greetings and salutations and all that shite. Greetings. Long way from Point Verdun, aren't you, Bear? Decided it was time to branch out. Not really a lot for me in that organization anymore. So what's your new line? Mind-melting narcotics. And I hear the best are coming out of Frisco. PCP. And it's cutting into my business. Okay. So where's the operation? Beats the hell out of me. But a while back, Miss Olivia Marcano hired a top-notch chemist named Bobby Bastian. Tasked him with upgrading her operations, which will make it impossible for the small-time cooks to compete. Hell, they even got taxis delivering their shit. If I can get to Bastion's dealers, maybe they'll give him up. Tell me something I can use against him. That ain't all. Word is Miss Marcano brought in a couple other eggheads from San Francisco. Get rid of them, and Bobby Bastion's gonna find himself nice and fucked. Put a beating on some of Bastion's guys, and maybe they'll tell you something useful. Okay. Okay. Bastion's taxi service delivers speed to bored housewives. <laughs> okay. Kill any dealers you find out. In the streets. Hmm. No problem. No problem. I parked my car over here. <laughs> okay, interrogate Bobby's dealers. Pete Lacour's a moron who's been busted bawling 
hookers in exchange for PCP on several occasions. <laughs> on several, not just one. Every time his ties with Bastion have got him have gotten him off the hook. Okay. Let's do this one first then. Let's go. Damage remaining, 50k, $50,000. Interrogates. Okay. This whole thing's going to shit when they legalize it all. Dope, speed, whatever. At some point, the assholes in Washington are going to figure out how to tax it, and you, me, Mr. Marcano, even. Mr. Marcano, even. Oh, oh I, I have that, um, sniper. What? Oh, God. Oops. You're not supposed to be back here. Ah! Shit. Hmm? Better figure out the cause of that smoke. Yeah, you better. We're all dead, don't you see? We're already gone. How the hell am I going to... Should I take one out? Okay. He ain't breathing. I gotta get out of here. Bingo, bitch. Where Fuck do you think you're going? Um. Move over, or I'll move you over. Yeah, wait, I don't wait, think so. What the hell are you doing? You better tell me what Bobby Bastion's up to. <laughs> that was a cop car. Okay. Speeding. You better talk. You better talk. Folks, don't even He's not tell talking. me the fucking time, I swear. Don't be mm -hmm. shy. Talk to me. Yeah, don't be shy. Don't Talk to me. Shit. I'm a fucking nobody. You think Talk this is a fucking me. game? Fine. Fuck it. Kill me. <gasps> what do I care? This only ends one way. You barely missed that, motherfucker. Okay. We drove the speed of our town using taxis. Last I heard, the boss was keeping the cash drops at the dispatch garage. <clears throat> oh, really? Thanks. Rob the taxi garage. This way. Okay. Ah. Oh. Uh, really? Did you not see me pulling up? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Okay, Rob, the taxi garage. Um. Oh, 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 here. Oh, there's a lot of red. There's a lot of, there's a lot of red. There's a lot of red. On the map, on the screen, there's a lot of red. Uh, I don't need ammo, right? I'm not gonna refill. I'll be fine. I'll be okay. I'll be okay. He said, no, 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 no. Get out of here. Somebody did. Okay. Run. 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 
Can I get him from here? Should we see? Oh, I'm a beast. Oh, I did it! I got him! Wow. There's another guy over here. Oh, there's another. There's a couple. <gasps> oh, he's a civilian. I was like, oh. Oh, he's on the... No, don't call the police. Don't call the police, oh strange, I've random man. Seen... Oh lord. <laughs> Look at him. He's like, oh no. This is not very good. This no, he's not a threat. That person over there is not a threat, apparently. Even though he looks like he could be. He's not. Sentry. Oh, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful man. So sad to end it all. Well, shit. Can't exactly ignore that. Oh, that man just well, like... shh, 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 shh. Oh, there's another one. Oh, God, grief. Motherfucker's got business to attend to. Yeah, you better, you better leave, son. You better leave, mister. Oh, shh! <laughs> uh. Okay. There's one more. There's a one more guy. There's a one more guy, guys. There's one more guy in this building over here. And... He is in a very awkward spot. <gasps> okay. <clears throat> and... We are in. We are in. This is very time consuming. Can I just say that? What's this? Read note. Look, I know the broads in this neighborhood don't seem like the type to do any drugs, but it's super effing easy. You go up to their door all polite, like, dressed in your best suit, and tell them that PCP is a great way for them to slim down. No dieting, no exercise, the pounds just melt away. By the time they figure out it's a crock, they're hooked and we're swimming in money. Mm. How do you like... You can't just like eat it, like you have to like smoke it or something, don't you? It's like all you have to do is smoke this dietary supplement that's gonna make you lose weight, feel great, and be slim, and get toned. And they're like, okay. <laughs> I've lost weight, but I've also lost my marriage, my children, my house, <laughs> my job. <laughs> um, okay. So... Uh, Beaks Brunner with Bastion's green light. Brunner clipped the old folks who lived here and moved in his cooking rig. Wow. He's been making products on the regular ever since. What a hell of a story. Sounds like a hell of a guy. <laughs> um, let's go take him out. <laughs> let's go take out Beaks. Beaks Brunner. Trespassing enemy turf. So, everyone here, I'm assuming, is not a threat, okay? Okay. I don't care, there's a sentry. There's only one. And he is in here. He's inside. That's tremendously helpful, isn't it? Yeah! Oh, God. 
just fuck go. Just take a break. <laughs> okay, there we go. Sentry. Now you're done. Is down. Sentry is down. Nope. Don't put you down, son. Don't you don't you even think about it. Don't you even think about it. Oh! Oh, you're so lucky, mister. You're lucky I missed that shot. Ooh. They are trying to flush me out. Can I get you? Yes, I did. Not bad, shotgun. Not bad little range you have. Whoa. You just... I got fresh dibs on this fucker. You don't have fresh dibs on nobody. Asshole off me. There we go. Nice. Nice. Nice, guys. Nice. Um. So there's a little something, something in here. Oh, is this a note? No, it's not readable. Oh, cash. A grand. Can't be mad at that. Got to stay way, way, way back. And. And. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Um, there should be one in here. Grab the cash. Little note. I will not be insulted like that again. Next time, please inform her that we are not some sort of Bayou Hicks operating out of a double wide. We are highly educated scientists. Okay. Okay. Highly educated scientists. Um, mm -hmm. Putting all their skills to really good use. Boom. Nice. Um, so. Who's next? Gabe. Both Bastion and his pal, Chauvin, knew the construction crew on this house would walk away for the right price and leave Chauvin to cook in peace. So, this is going to be a little awkward because we are on a very residential street. Okay. Ooh. One sentry. I always like to take out the sentry first, but we might not get an option to. Maybe we can't be picky. All of his crew is dead and he has no knowledge yet. Let's read this. <laughs> Let's have a bit of a read. We're running low on Pepperidin. So Mr. Bastion needs you to make another run up to Baton Rouge. Carl's cancer came back, so you'll be dealing with his brother Francis. Francis will probably invite you in for some supper, so don't go acting like you're in a goddamn hurry. Head on in there, eat his catfish, and come on back. So, let's silence. Let's use the silencer. What? Oh, God. Huh? Yeah, we'll just do it like that. <clears throat> Get the money and how am I gonna do this without blowing up guys? 
How am I going to do this without blowing up? Shh, grenade. I really do I don't want to like, I don't want to die. Okay. That works. Cool. Nice. What's this? Money? Wow. Alright. Talk to Bear Donnelly. It's been a bad couple of days Good. for old Bobby Bastion. Far less of his product out on the street than he and Miss Marcano would like. Sounds like good news for you. I mean, it doesn't hurt. What are things looking like at the lab? Is Bastion there? Yeah, and in a fucking state. Apparently, the Marcanos aren't too happy about the cash flow disruption. Yeah, well, let's see how they feel about losing their drug lab. And Bear, sell what you're gonna sell. But you better steer well clear of the hollow. Well, you know where to find Bastion. Go get the fucker. Mm. Confront Bobby Bastion. Let's go get him, Lincoln. Let's go get Bobby. Bastion is a... Bastion, you would think, is like short for like Sebastian. Oh, it's a high curb. I'm probably gonna. Oh. I feel like I should refill my ammo before we go in there. Because. That would be a pretty smart move. It'd be safe. It'd be safe to do, I think. Unless. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, oh, wow. There's a lot of, there's a lot, there's a lot in there. There's a lot of people in there. So. I'm in Frisco and I can use some supplies. We are directly. Oh, I have like 20k on me. I need to get rid of my cash as well. <laughs> oh, I don't want to die and lose all of it. Everything you see is for sale. Everything I see is for sale. Oh, my ammo is full. It is now. Okay, equipment. Screaming Zemi. Yes. Frag. Grenades. Yes. C4 charge. No. Sniper support. I need this. I need to use this. Um, supplies. Definitely need some shots. Okay. Attack first. Mm, not Didn't so much. I'm hitting up. Let's call up. Betty. Frisco. Get somebody to take this cash off. Be there soon. Be there soon. She is so quick. She is so no on it. We have 90k. Obviously, she picks up the kickback as well, so. We've got a whole lot of money. It's not even funny. <laughs> But how do I get into the door? How do I get into the building? Duval Hall Science Center. Hmm. Okay. This is why it's gonna get tough. Ba 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 ba. I risked it. I risked it. It didn't pay off. Shh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Shh, 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 shh. Who's gunning you down? I think you're being a little paranoid. <sighs> Sentry! No, it's too bright! I can't see him! I can't see him. <gasps> oh, I th oh, that's a lie. The sentry's gonna call their people. You know what? Forget it. You 
You know what? Bring it on. You know what? I don't care. The sentry's on the move. <laughs> Maybe I do care. <laughs> oh, you s- Ooh. Oh, don't you even, don't you even, don't you even. Yes! Yes! No! Okay. Molotov? Yep, I heard, I heard it being thrown. I knew it was on its way. And I took care of it. <laughs> uh. Oh. He's all yours, boys. Back me up, boys. Gotta be on him. Can I just shoot off his right arm? Get out of here. Follow me. Hi, fella. Okay. Oh, that got very messy very quickly. There's one upstairs. No. There's one over here. A soul. God, there's two sentries. Okay. I love how you can hear them panting, like... <laughs> Just dying. No, I was gonna use these sets. Are you telling me I can't? What? Huh? <gasps> Ooh, hello you. Circle back and see if he's over there. See if he's over there. <laughs> I need to stop. <laughs> Another body! Looks like a leg. Circle back. See if he's over there. Only so many places to hide, partner. Oh, yeah, partner. Take it! Boy, the hell! Grab him some cover! <gasps> I did not shoot off his arm, did I? Oh, there's no way. Oh, I have to go and see. I don't care about anything else right now. Don't look back. Just get to the phone. Oh. Uh, excuse me? What? No. <laughs> get to the phone? What phone? You? Oh, no. <gasps> Another one. Don't you even think about it. Where are you? Nice. Nice. Ooh. Oh, I got him. I got him. I got him. Go fuck up that asshole. Excuse me? You guys just saw that, right? I mean <laughs> Whoa, that was that was hilarious. That was funny. Don't you know your game? <laughs> uh. Okay. Oh, I can't see. What if I pick him up? Where the hell did he get to? No, he's still got his arm. Oh, that's 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 a shame. Um, guy coming through the this door. There we go. Got him. Over here. Over here. Where? Oh I've shh. Stat. Standing there all menacing. He ran straight into that, so I can't complain. There I am. Oh, I know, Bobby. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about you. <gasps> oh, you. Oh, uh. Oh, uh. Okay, run. Fuck me! Do whatever you're gonna do. Just don't leave me to Olivia. Shit.
PCP racket secured. Nice. Okay. Um, ba -ba -bum. Ba -dum -bum. Ooh. Cassandra. So nobody has rackets in this current district. So really, I'm, I'm free reign to give it to whoever. Um, bulletproof tires, tires and all vehicles are now completely bulletproof. Covert car theft, Burke will teach you how to quietly steal a parked car. Supercharger for veto, significantly boost the top speed and acceleration significantly. Oh. Stamina and recovery boost one. Run and swim longer and recover health faster. Oh, but Vito has so many good stuff to offer me. Tires and all vehicles are now completely bulletproof. That's a pretty, that's a pretty... Ah. Uh, but you know... This one, I'm going to have to give it to Vito. Giving it to Vito. Only way we're going to hold on to Frisco Fields is if you send some of your boys. Consider it done. They'll be there before you know it. Okay, good. Okay, good. Great. They were all showing up in like the same suits and the hats and everything. Doesn't it doesn't get old. <laughs> After I was discharged, I wandered around for a couple of three months, did some odd jobs. I got arrested once or twice for fighting. But I always kind of knew I was going into seminary. It just took a little while for it to sink in, I suppose. Once I was done with seminary, Bishop Jenkins sent me to St. Michelle's home for colored boys. <laughs> that orphanage was a pile of shit from the day I got there till the day I left. <laughs> but I loved it. <laughs> I loved having those boys. PCP racket secured. Associate gained mob doctor three. Speed up health bar recovery. Okay. Oh, got a whole lot of cash on the table. 3k. $3,500. Nice. That was another 125. 1,250, I should say. It wasn't $125. Um, I don't need any more shots. So I'm just going to skedaddle out of here. I'm just going to go boop and just leave. Um, Lincoln, will you tell these simple fucks that you've got to react to PCC with the green R reagent in a completely dry environment? Uh huh, uh huh. Guys, listen to that guy, guys. All right, guys. <laughs> All right, so. Where are we going to now? Southern Union. Donovan's called in a favor with a friend who carries shared interests in Frisco Fields. So let us go and talk to Jackie Grimaldi. Come in. We're open. Okay, I hope so, because I'm supposed to meet Jackie here. I think you're looking for me? Yes, I am. Jackie, a mutual friend sent me. <laughs> I figured Johnny was lying when he said he had a friend. The cloak and dagger acts a bit much, though. You know Donovan? You could say that. I'm a special agent with Treasury. The IRS is looking into Olivia Marcano? Pretty sure she's smart enough to pay her taxes. 
I'm investigating a man who works for her, Chester Moreau. From what I've been able to piece together, he finances the Southern Union. Figured those racist fucks had factored into this somehow. Man I'm after, Remy Duval, is a grand poopa or some shit. Whatever the connection, it's deep, it's secret, and it's bringing in a lot of money. Much more than you'd expect from a territory like Frisco Fields. The Bureau looked into it for a while, but no one's talking. Trust me, I get my hands on one of those bastards, he's talking. I thought as much. Only other lead I have is that the Southern Union's got stashes of propaganda scattered around the neighborhood. Might not seem like much, but you hit those, you'll get the attention of the people who matter. Yeah. Moreau starts losing money, he's gonna want to know why. I'll be back once I have something actionable. No one's really talking around here. I think you're gonna have to get to Chester's people directly. Gotcha. The Southern, the Southern Union peddles racist literature and paraphernalia to turn a quick buck. Wreck any you find to hurt their cash flow. Okay. Um, interrogate Southern Union brothers. Chester's got so much dough coming into Frisco, he bought himself a minister known as Brother Simon to launder their cash through his 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 church. His his church. His church. Okay, let's go. Let's go do some interrogating. Some more interrogating. <laughs> At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if Lincoln enjoyed it to some degree. You know? I mean, I was going to say... There's, like, no resistance from his part. He's done so much already. We have the, the, amount, of st the amount of people that we've interrogated, killed, taken out, the amount of businesses we've taken over single-handedly pretty much is you know but it's all for a good cause revenge vengeance okay dark Fuck. dark lincoln sorry about blowing up like that just uh dealing with some of these assholes act like they shit don't stink because they got a little money motherfuckers I got money too. I just don't have to go around using it to put my name on every goddamn thing. Asshole. Something's going down. Something's going down. Get out of here. He's not going anywhere. I got a beat on Sometimes, you know, it's better to just go up and punch them. You Don't know why I bother. You tell me all about Chester Moreau's operation. Mr. Moreau's got some of our other Southern Union guys on a job for him. A big one. A secret. Yeah. Can't trust a fucking rat. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> so aggressive! So aggressive! Okay. Kill the Southern Union Enforcers. You want me to go all the way out of my way? All the way out of my way? Um, I think we'll do that. Uh, Come round. Yeah, okay. So who am I t Uncle Andrew? Let's read. Uncle Andrew, fifth generation Southern Union dipshit, proving his worth through violence. Oh. Miss Mother. I am your mother. Oh, God. Oh, he's got. Oh, they've got. There's a. Ah. Uh. Ugh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is what you need. Tell me I did not miss that shot. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Are you for real? 
Are you for real? Are you serious? I missed that shot. I don't think I did. I'm gonna go ahead and say that I didn't. <laughs> and then it was the game. You better put that phone down now, Sonny. Just the two of us. Okay. See? That's what I should do more of. Oh, pick up the cash. Nope. Just the cash. Don't need the gun. Gonna leave the gun. Okay. Uh, who's next? Uncle... Thaddeus, this head case went to war filled with rage and came back with even more. Only now, Chester's channeled that anger and targeted targeted it towards the black and poor citizens of the city. Oh, this house is so stunning. Oh, what a shame. I'm going to have to bloody up the place. Okay. And I'm sneaking in, and I'm being sneaky, and I'm being sneaky. Because my car's in the shop. Uh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, my friend. See you later. Whoa. Um. This here's off limits. Oh, God. Huh? 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 What? 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 Huh? <laughs> okay. Huh? You're such a liar. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. Get your little skinny bad body away from me. No! 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 no. I died. Oh. Guys. 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 I died. <laughs> Uh, okay. It's just like a millisecond off from healing myself. But I got him. But I got him. So that should count. Um, and I feel like we should be able to move on to the next uncle. Uncle James, we have came for you. Okay, he is just up here. Aha. Uh -huh. Sentry. Good. Uh, uh, you better leave him alone. Pretty happy with that. Uh, I think the guys got away. So we saved the victims, which is good. Oh, I see an opening. This is good. Can I fit through the tree? Yes, I can. <laughs> okay. Uh, interrogate. Oh. Um, 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 um. Don't you even think about it. Don't you even think about it. 
What the hell is happening here? You want to live? You tell me all about Chester Moreau's operation. Right. <laughs> if you want, if you want to live, like we give them an option. There's no option. Well, there is an option, but I always. You about to kill both of us? Choose tell me what otherwise. I need to know. I love how for him this is speeding. For me, this is just how I drive. Who the fuck's gonna tell me anything? Stop wasting my fucking time. The Belly is supermarket. There's something going on there after hours. Whatever it is, Mr. Moreau's trying to keep it real quiet. Thanks. Later. <laughs> Talk to Jackie. Okay. Time to go back to Jackie. <sighs> and here we are, back at Jackie's. Let me just do this properly. Right. Fuck up. Okay. We are back with some news. What do you need? Did you learn anything? Hit those bastards pretty hard and all I got was a single word. Bel Air. Hmm. You know something? That tracks. Moreau is the majority owner of Bel Air Supermarket. As soon as you started hitting those racist assholes, the phones lit up. No one mentioned the Bel Air by name, but I did get a time. 10 p.m. And enough circumstantial evidence to tie it all together. Whatever's going on, it's happening at that supermarket tonight. I'll look into it. Lincoln, listen. The thing some of those guys were hinting at, it's bad. Real bad. So go in quiet. We need to find out exactly what Moreau is up to, and we won't get another chance. You got it, Jackie. Hmm. Wait for nightfall. Investigate Bella's grocery store. And go in quiet. Go in quiet, she said. Which is always. Which is always good advice. Hey, let's wait. Whew. Ain't this the life of adventure? How can they breathe with the bags over their heads? Get inside Bel Air's. Hmm. Okay. Think you'll make it to Gates? Maybe. They're just getting started upstairs. <laughs> How's tonight's crop looking? <laughs> Pathetic. We only got a couple tonight, which means the crowd's gonna want to stick around, get drunk, maybe gloat a bit about being rich. Well, swing by if you can make it. But I gotta head up soon, before another of these pricks goes tattling to Mr. Moreau. I'll catch you later. I was waiting for that conversation to end. Mr. Marcano and the Southern Union. Thank you for coming out tonight. Mr. Moreau has asked me to remind you that we're only accepting cash. And for an additional nominal fee, all purchases will be safely transported to a location of the buyer's choosing. Now, first up on the block is this lively specimen, freshly... Again, this is a fine specimen, no visible injuries or scars, and examined personally by Mr. Moreau's doctors. They better not be talking about people. Please. Just let me go. <gasps> at $1,000. You... Do I hear $1,000? $1,000. Do I hear two? $2,000? You can't oh do this. $3,000 to the man in front. $3,000. Four. Do I hear five? $5,000. Sold for $5,000. You motherfuckers. Don't worry, I got you. Fear. Fear. 
Give me a hand. Where is he? Did he run? I think he did. Where are the others? Chess has got them niggas around Frisco. Just make it fucking quick, dead motherfucker. Rest in peace, asshole. Oh. Oh, he is going straight to hell. <laughs> wow. Marcano reinforcements are coming for you? What? But I didn't see any sentries. Ooh, a note. <laughs> A lot of big wigs are coming to town for this and they're expecting a quality product. You bring me the best you got. Get them nice and cleaned up so they're presentable. F this up and it's your ass. Miss Meccano already warned you once and she ain't gonna do it a second time. This is really far out. They knew what they they knew what they were doing when they picked this spot. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Ooh, ah, e. Two more. Someone over here. Someone else, no? Ah. Over here. Okay. Okay, that's it. That's all of them. Now we have to go inside and rescue the people. I feel like genuinely the most pointless thing on this game i feel like is moving bodies thank, thank you you're so welcome ah, I left my windows down. what i think it's done raining did she really just say that she ran away and said oh i think i left my windows down and then i think it stopped raining so maybe she was worried that she left something on her windowsill at home and it's getting completely wet or I, but she was like and well the rain has stopped and it hasn't it hasn't stopped raining it's still raining so i don't really know what that was about <laughs> you can find chester moreau at the grocery store how'd you find him I had a hunch, so I sat on an apartment in the French ward that's listed under his youngest kid's name. Fucker's been holed up there. He slipped back into Frisco with some cronies in tow. I think he figures if Olivia doesn't get to him, you will. You all right? Fuck no. Those poor people. I've got an old friend from the State Department who's going to help them. But Moreau. Moreau. That asshole Remy Duval. They've got to answer for what they've done. All of it. No, I agree. You have my word. Jesus, when I found out what they were doing, you have to stop Moreau. Kill Chester Moreau. Mm, don't mind if I do. All right, so I got some new upgrades for Lincoln. I am back down under 100K. <laughs> um, I spent quite a bit of money. But sometimes, you know, sometimes you have to. Sometimes you really have to. Okay. I'm going in. Five hundred dollars to the man who kills that cocksucker. Through the back. That nigga be stupid. Oh sh. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. There's two more on this level. Got a sentry. There's another guy. There's another two. Keep your eyes open here. 
Mr. Moreau says that nigger might be coming after us. Don't worry. If I see something, I'll hold. Slightest movement can save their life. And it did until it didn't. Okay. To be fair, I didn't really need to, like, take them out. I did. <laughs> but I did. I don't really want to grab this vest until I need it, but I'm just going to grab it anyways. How do I go upstairs? By using the stairs, of course. Oh. Huh? Okay. Really? He didn't see me. Nope. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Sentry, sentry. Okay. There's one guy downstairs. Somehow I missed him. But I... He's not what I'm here for. So, fuck me. You know what I'm going to do? I got him. Give it to a goddamn. There we go. You whatever you want. I'll do whatever you want. Just don't kill me. But what I want is for you to die. I wanted to throw in a couple of punches. Slave trade secured. Um. Um. Rackets in current district. Veto. Really? Okay. Looks like I've got to give this to Veto then. We want to keep it all together, you know. So um. Um, yeah, I'm going to give it to Vito. Mark at the next call to Vito's associates will be in the house. Enforcer hit squad. Enforcer led the squad will be armed with a shotgun and a machine gun. I f okay. Sign to Vito. Took down Bel Air and Frisco Fields. Just so we're clear. We'll not be using this place to fucking sell people. Find another way to make money from it. Sure thing, Lincoln. My boys are on the way. They won't let you down. Okay, so now I need to focus on Thomas. Thomas. Uh, and I need to give him some... Some rackets. Did they just run over that poor lady? They just ran her over. Look at her. She's on the road, dying. Remy Duvall came from one of the most respected and wealthiest families in Louisiana. He invested in everything from oil wells to real estate, and he used his social status to get a radio program. Now, he used his radio show to preach about the collapse of polite society and the superiority of the Southern way of life. His family had been here for a couple of centuries, so his death was a shock. But even more shocking was the revelation that he was associated with the Southern Union, a group of wealthy racists who used their social positions to agitate against blacks. Remy Duval, he was crucified and then burned alive. How do you justify that type of behavior? Remy came from a long line of Southern cocksuckers, was always quick to trot out that war of Northern aggression and the South will rise again bullshit. Here's the thing about Remy. In 1965, he participated in the murder of four civil rights workers. 
one of whom they decapitated. They never found her head, so fuck him, he got what he deserved. Wow. Donovan's got more on Remy Duvall. Story mission unlocked, kill Remy Duvall. <gasps> no way. Already? Already? Associate gained Enforcer Hit Squad. Call in heavier backup. Wow. Okay. Uh, so yeah. There's a war going on. Kill Remy Duvall. Remy Duvall spouted hate from the safety of a recording booth. Show him there's no safe place left for him. Donovan's got more on Remy Duvall. So... You have to go back to Donovan. And I guess that means we are going to going uh, we are going to be going after Remy Duval. So I'm gonna pause it here for today, you guys. Uh, and we will come back in the next part, which will be tomorrow. Um to take out Remy and I guess then move on to bigger fish but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this part of mafia 3 hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you did then you know what to do but otherwise i will see you guys in my next video